Since our last update in June, uh, works have been continuing on the A164 and Jocks Lodge project. So starting in the south at Skidby um, and working our way to Lazats, we have been installing the vehicle restraint system. We've also been topping up and finishing off some of the topsoiling and we have now started laying the finished bituminous surface course. So continuing north from Lazats up towards Dunflat Road, we have been continuing with uh, installing topsoil between the new footway and the drainage kerb. We've also been finishing off the kerbing, stoning up and installation of the bituminous surface course on the new cycle footway as well. On Dunflat Road Junction, we've been continuing to install the road kerbs inside the Splitter Island and also stoning up the island ready for the bituminous surface to be installed. So moving on down then to Bentley Village, we have now started removing the embankment on the eastern side. This is so that we're able to tie in the new A164 alignment into the existing A164. So, so far this month, the works have consisted of excavating out the soil down to formation, installing the capping stone and installing the new drainage. So continuing north, um, heading back towards the A1079 on the A164 alignment, we have now been installing the base and binder bituminous layers on the new highway alignment. So moving on to the uh, new Bentley Bridge, we have now completed all the works at backfilling the stone behind the abutments and we have installed the new waterproofing layer on top of the bridge deck. And continuing north from the bridge, you may be able to see now that we have continued building the embankment to be able to tie in down where the Jocks Lodge lights are. So that brings us to the A1079 roundabout um, and works this month we have been concentrating on the northwestern leg of the existing A1079 and that has been installing the new surface water drainage in also stirring that up and in preparation to install the new concrete V-channel. And so heading north um, from the A1079, uh, we have now been able to complete the final part of the Northern Link Road, so that now attaches to the roundabout. So finally moving up to Minster and Lincoln Way, starting at Victoria Roundabout um, and heading east, we have been concentrating on installing all of the new concrete road kerbs and pin kerbs to the rear of the new footway, stoning up the footway and installing the topsoil uh, moving on to the regiment roundabout itself, uh, we have been removing all the old drainage in there, installing some new drainage and ducting ready for the, the new street lights to be installed. And moving further east, uh, we've also started excavating out and, and installing the capping stone where the road is going to be widened and getting ready to install the new street lighting. And as always, if you are interested in the scheme and want to follow with any updates, please go to our website on a164jockslodge.co.uk, sign up for our newsletter and follow us on socials.